waiting on this kid for? He's coming out, Johnny. He's coming out. Finish him out. You gotta get on him. You better get out. Get on him. Bullshit. You need to trabajar, Pablo. You, got, you in here? You in here? Huh? Come on, Roy. You gotta, Johnny. You gotta fucking do what you gotta do. This fucking Roy is doing everything, man. Come on. Norman Stone just called his fighter Roy. Tell me. Tell me. Let him get away. John, we gotta put this in second gear, baby. Johnny, we gotta put this in second gear. Johnny, he's gonna camp you, Kip Brown. Get out there and fight this motherfucker. We gotta make it a fight, fight now. Come in at an angle. Start banging him. Oh, we'll Wait, all right. You can't just walk around him, John. You gotta move your hands. I just motherfucker! This is it, John. Fight him! Go and get him! Go and fight this fucking Keep guy! Your hands up! You think you go to the body? You come up to the head! Come up come to on. the head! Fight him! Come on, Johnny! Fight him! The He's referee. taking He's your done. fucking title away from you! The referee sucks! Done. All you work this for! The ref sucks! Fight him! Fuck the referee! Come on! Get out there! Fight him! Come on! Fight him! Come on. Come on. The oh, referee come on. sucks! Come on, John! Fight this motherfucker! The referee sucks! The genteel stylings of Norman Stone in the Ruiz corner. Yeah, he's trying to give a transfusion of spirit to Ruiz. They're trying to put a, a personality into John Ruiz that, as you pointed out, Larry, isn't really his. And we have to remember that it was Jones's mild mannered tra trainer, Orton Merkerson, who, uh, who belted Stoney himself the other day. Yeah. Knocked him down, sent him to the hospital. Johnny, you gotta fight, man. You back the yourself up. You back yourself on corner now. The referee stuck! You gotta go out and knock him out. No if the hands about it. You gotta go out and knock him out. Come on, water. Come on. Water. Push the water over his head. Come on. Johnny, you gotta go out and knock this motherfucker out. There's no if the hands about it. Come on, let's see what you're all about now. All right? We're gonna see what you're all about. Come on, come on, come on. One more round. Fight Get out of our corner. Get out of our corner. Fight behind you. Get out of our corner. Fight behind you. I'm gonna fight out your bed on. I'm gonna fight behind you. I'll take the fight. He held the whole fight. Johnny, come on and go get him, Johnny. He held the whole fight. Keep him out there. Keep him out there. Come on, come on. Come on. Come on. That's why you're pissed off at Cortez. You said he would have taken a point. Now I know. You gotta keep your own. You're in the bed. Come on. One of the good things that's happening is here, we'll never, probably never have to see Norman Stone again. Victory celebration in the Jones corner. John Ruiz tentatively held his fist up in the air and then sort of quietly walked back into his own corner. No badges or nothing. Again! Now Norman Stone wants to control ring security. In addition to all the other good things he's done. Absolutely, do what you're comfortable with, right? Right. Now here's the first instance, and as Sam Colonna, the trainer for Andrew Galata, comes into the ring, Norman Stone <laughs> runs all the way across the ring, puts his hand on Colonna's chest, and pushes it. There's Stoney. <laughs> yeah. Nobody Ronnie, in the sport it. more aggressively Ronnie, protects their on. fighter or thinks they aggressively protect their fighter what like the Norman Stone. You gotta love Norman. Hey. Hi. This is glove. reminiscent of the night in December 1999 oh, when Andrew Galata took a big lead glove, over on. Michael Grant in their fight in Atlantic City. All the time you want. And you stopped it. Fucking asshole. What a piece of shit you turned out to be! What a fucking piece of shit! <laughs> you got no fucking balls, you pop sucker! Boy, that's a nice way to get on the referee's right side. I feel like I need to give that round to Randy Newman. Let's keep it up. One more time, you're up. You're not doing your job. You're not doing your job. Randy Newman has told Stone. One more outburst like that. You're out of here. Hit the streets, baby. Ah. Ref's doing a terrible fucking job, Johnny. He don't know what he's doing. 
Listen to me. Listen, that was a good one. will be able to stop the action, send Ruiz to his corner where his close friend Norman Stone can take the gloves up. Could occasion another conversation, but no, Stoney's on his good behavior now. <laughs> Maybe he feels Joe Ruiz needs to rest now. Fucking jerk off. <laughs> okay, That's our Stoney. Well, he's, he's ordering Stone out of the corner. Well, he Harold that. Letterman, our in-house historian, is saying that this is unprecedented well, in his view. He does not remember a trainer ever being thrown out of a corner. I'll sue you for every fucking thing you got, you fucking. What a class act. And so now John Ruiz will go the rest of the way, apparently, without his trainer in his corner. Because Randy Newman has banished hey, Norman Stone. Alex! Alex! You take over! Let's get this one. I'm sure this, this one. Every fucking thing he's got. Everything. What did I say to him? Okay. I didn't say a word to him. Keep walking, please. I won't put your pocket. I'm not putting my hands up. Please. Let's go, gentlemen, let's go. Hey, that's it, that's it, that's it, that's it. And this time they don't fight after the bell. And Ruiz wanders a little bit looking for his corner. And there's Norman Stone alone in the dressing room and not happy. Banished this, from Ruiz's definitely corner. This is the worst referee I've ever seen in boxing. He hasn't taken a point away. He hit Johnny in the back of the head, knocked him down. He's the something worst. Something wrong here. I don't know what it is, but there's something definitely wrong. Yeah. I yeah. never said nothing to that guy. <laughs> Let's take a look at one of the moments when Ruiz landed a big punch in the 12th round. That right hand on the jaw of Andrew Galata. Right over top of his head. And here was Norman's reaction. He got him. He got him. Oh, that was a beautiful there you go. Uh, Come on, Johnny. He loves his fighter. Yes, he does. You can't get mad at him for that. See. You tend to think if Rockman could get his gloves on Bird as much as McClain did tonight, maybe the Rock. To the winner by unanimous decision and still WBA heavyweight champion of the world, the quiet man, John Ruiz. Zeit Berliner. Nikolai Valuyev, der jetzt verkabelt wird. Er ist ja im Grunde genauso wie John Ruiz, nicht gerade der große Talker. Auch auf ihn würde The Quiet Man passen. Was ist da jetzt los? Norman Stone tickt aus, der ist schon mal aus dem Madison Square Garden geflogen beim Kampf gegen Golota. Er hat den Gürtel, er hat sich den Gürtel genommen und hält ihn hoch. Oh, jetzt kommt Akku Silvecke dazu. Was ist denn jetzt los? Jetzt geht es da ab. Im Ring, meine Güte. Riesenaufregung. Die Security ist mit drin. Akku Silvecke in der Ecke, ja immer. Beim Sauerlandstall. Norman Stone berüchtigt auch in den USA. Wenn man ihn privat spricht, ein netter Typ. Aber heute flippt er aus. Da ist der Gürtel wieder beim Weltmeister. Sie kriegen ihn langsam ruhiger gestellt, ja? Er ist unbeeindruckt, wartet darauf, dass er zum Interview fertig ist. Geht nochmal rüber, schießt nochmal rüber hier in die Ecke zu Norman Stone. Jetzt klettert er hier direkt vor unseren Augen durch die Ringseile. Immer noch noch. Er regt nicht ganz her seiner Sinne.